Hello everyone, happy Tuesday. I hope you all are having a fantastic Tuesday. We are so excited to be here because a lot of you guys have been getting <clears throat> your maker material boxes and we are so excited to be able to share with you guys how to use some of the amazing patterns that are in your maker material box. Now we are just so thrilled that you guys are getting those and if there are any issues or anything regarding to your first shipment of boxes, be sure to send us an email request. Hi at makers, gonna learn, excuse me, dot com. Don't include the excuse me. But um, we are so excited to have you guys. Now today is a very, very important day because if you want our September shipment of the box, you have got to get in today so that you're able to make all your Christmas ornaments with us, guys. This box right here is everything you get in your September shipment, and it'll be being shipped out very, very soon. So if you want your September shipment box, you guys need to go ahead and get confirmation on your Maker Material box today. Today is the last day to sign up for your Maker Material box. So we're really excited for that and really thrilled to be able to send those out to you. And again, if you commit to six months or one year, you are going to be able to go ahead and get a special surprise that is going to be shipped out in the next few weeks. Um, we are actually, you know, final call almost on these special gifts. So if you would like one, you need to get in quick. So go ahead and get your six month commitment or your uh, 12 month, one year commitment um, to Maker Material boxes and you are going to get over $100 of value in the box every single month. Now, what we love about our Maker Material box if you guys did not already know, is that you get custom pattern vinyl. This is one that was in our August box, and we'll talk about what you get in your September box today. But we're also making a project from our August box. So I'm so excited. Um, this is a please take one. So you'll place this on your Thanksgiving decor or anything like that um, for when you're having get togethers this fall or anything. It's so much fun. I love it. And this pattern has some really adorable fall colors. So, Rachel, what has everyone got going on? Well, Joanne wants to know, do, will we know what's inside all of our boxes before they're shipped? Yes. So, Joanne, we'll go over briefly this box today, um, but we also had to have videos independently promoting that box. So, it is super great, and we're really excited to talk about this Maker Material box. Now, if you guys are brand new to Cricut, let us know. If you're brand new to our YouTube channel, leave us a comment, and again, let us know so we are able to welcome you into the community. Um, it is sometimes overwhelming when you are first new to our channel, so we want to make sure it is simple as possible. So let us introduce ourselves. I'm Tanner. Rachel's behind the camera taking care of you guys in the comments and pulling out those questions to make sure they're answered. Um, and we run a membership site called makersgonnalearn.com. We are here to teach you guys exactly how to master your die cutting machine and give you access to over 1,400 plus cut files and over 200 fonts only found in our YouTube year membership tier. Now, a lot of people always ask, Tanner, why is the year membership valued so much over the monthly? And it's because you guys invest in us, therefore we invest in you in a few different ways. One, you save $48 being a yearly member versus being a monthly member for a year. So right out of the gate, you're saving 48 bucks, which equates to three months of membership. Second of all, you get bonuses. Our bonuses are so important. You get access to our font library, which we love, over 200 commercial use fonts um, for year members. Speaking of commercial use license, you get the commercial license to use with all of our artwork, um, meaning you can make money with your machine. And third of all, you get access to three training classes that are over $150 worth of value, completely free. We'll teach you how to use your machine, how to master the software, and then how to build a business using your machine. So love that. Yes, um, we have we some questions. It. Well, let's hit <coughs> them. Let's me. hit them real quick. Yeah, let's they're do for it. the box too. Woohoo! So the Allison box. says, do you need a PayPal to pay for it? So we do partner with PayPal as our number one payment provider, um, and you are able to link your credit card, debit card, bank account, or e-check um, to your PayPal account to pay for your box. And that way, me, Rachel, or any of the Makers Gonna Learn team does not even have to 
take care or handle or worry about your credit card information at night because we don't want it to get stolen. Therefore, that's why we partner with PayPal. And it honestly, guys, does cost us quite a bit in fees to use PayPal, but I believe from a consumer perspective that it's one of the safest ways to pay online. And CJ says, is there a surprise with every month's box or just a one-time surprise? CJ, that's a great question. So it's a one-time surprise if you um, commit to six months or a year. It's a free gift um, and it is a one-time surprise for you when you commit to six months or one year of Maker Materials. Now, the price for a one-year subscription to Maker Materials is a hefty fee. I understand that wholeheartedly. Um, it is expensive, but just remember you're getting $1,200 of value and you're having to have 12 different packages shipped out to you. So therefore, it is obviously a pretty large fee. So, yes. uh, Melanie says, what does she have to do to get her box next month? <gasps> Melanie, all you need to do to get your box next month is to click that link um, that Rachel has just dropped for Maker Materials. You can also find it in the description down below for Maker Materials and you can get signed up for a month, three months, six months, or a year. And today is the last day to get in on Maker Materials. So, super fun. Dazzling D! Oh my gosh, I'm new, just received a Cricut Maker, and I'm wondering if I have to have a paid membership to join your Facebook group. Thanks in advance. Um, Dazzling D, yes, the membership Facebook group is um, the only Facebook group that I run, and it is so much fun. So it is a paid membership perk. It is a small community, but man, is it a hefty community. We have so much support and love for you, and congratulations on your machine. We are so excited that you have said yes to the Cricut Maker. So we highly recommend you guys, if you have said yes to a Cricut or a die cutting machine, um, to say yes to the membership so that we can help you guys stay creative and master the machine. So yeah, congratulations. How many of you have ordered, uh, pre-ordered the Silhouette Cameo 4? Can we talk about that? Oh my that? gosh, is that out? It is out today. Oh now, my gosh. there are a lot of things happening out in the universe, but guys, I do have to say, I feel a shift in me, and that was the biggest woo-woo thing I've said all year, um, but I am getting down into like this work mode, and I feel like I'm not even paying attention to the typical stuff out in the day. One of the reasons why I'm not at the Silhouette event today, but there's also a new iPhone coming out today, Rachel. What, today? what? Yeah. They're announcing oh the new iPhone. What's it called? Do you, does anybody know? Is it out yet? I think their event started at one today too. Oh my How many gosh. people do we have crafting with us? 102 people. Well, hello everyone. We're really excited to make this project and answer all your questions. Um, this one's a really great project to master, you know, being able to work with vinyl. And a lot of people have questions on pattern vinyl. And this is one of our exclusive patterns. So before we make the project, let's look at our September box for everyone that may already have the box or that, you know, is super excited. Um, Renee's going to the launch. Yeah, I think there's several people talking about going to the Silhouette launch. I love yeah. it. I hope you all enjoy the Silhouette launch. Um, say hey to Troy for me. Say hey to Ken. Uh, Teresa Collins may be there. I know, um, you know, she's hanging with Ken quite often. I don't know who else. Oh, Carly Hall is going to be there. She is one of our amazing Summit instructors um, and a dear sweet friend of mine. Spoke with her yesterday. She will be there, so give her some love. Um, I forget who else. So Catherine says, I ordered a maker yesterday. Should I sell my Explorer 2? That's a Catherine, good question. That is totally up to you. Um, and you can try to sell it to make some more money to buy material, or you can keep two. It's totally up to you. Um, depending on the price you think you can sell it for, maybe gift it to another crafty friend. I don't know. And Joanne just popped in with a really good hey, question. Hey, Joanne. She said, I'm a yearly member, but really haven't done much yet. Okay. Am I supposed to download all of the fonts onto your site to my computer, even if I don't use them all? No. So we here's the way we operate at Makers Gonna Learn, and this is probably a way that you guys could operate as well. We use makersgonnalearn.com um, because we don't download all of the fonts on our devices and computers and things. So we go to the site, pick a font, download it and then design with it. We, there's no need to download all of them. It is a very dainty task. Yeah. So don't worry about that um, unless you just really would like to. Yeah, so you can download fonts one by one and cut files one by yep, one. So exactly. it's super easy. So it's so much fun. Nikki says hello from Dallas, Texas. You guys know I'm a huge fan of Dallas, Texas. Um, and I also just got back from a Ladies Tuesday morning Bible study. I love that. Rachel, is tonight your Bible study? 
It's not, but it's normally on Tuesday nights, Nikki. I usually have a Tuesday night Bible study, mm -mm. too. Mm -mm. Did it's they cancel this Thursday. week on? Oh. Yeah. Okay. One, of, one of the people in the group is a nurse, and her mm. schedule comes first. So if <laughs> She's she works, serving the patients. Yeah, yeah. I love it. Well, guys, let's take a look at the box. Now, I do want to let you all know, this is what I call our mock box. So your box for the first um, six months of our subscription will be in a 651 box. Um, it is a 14 by four by four box and it is efficiently packing all your material. This right here would cost you probably triple in shipping to ship exactly like we have outlined all of the amazing things. So I'm just going to reference that. As soon as you open up the box, you're going to see that you get a lot of things in here. Not only do you get bases, do you get vinyl, transfer tape, you actually get tools like our amazing um, silicone, what is the proper word for it? It's just the silicone red tool holder. I love this tool holder. Um, I demoed it, you know, on the camera you last week. You can there. stick honestly, honestly, all your weeding tools, anything in the world that you want, you're able to just pop in there and they're going to be able to hold it for you and you will be getting the red color so a lot of people said will it be mystery color will it, you know whatever you will be getting the red color so you're also getting the red um, scraper tool now I love this squeegee this is really good I've been talking about um, wanting to use more of these and we've been testing these and they're really awesome and just better to burnish so we'll actually feature this in today's video so I'm gonna sit it to the side um, but yeah so if you need a new tool caddy what I love in our box is you will see that our box is a little bit more expensive than some of uh, other subscription boxes but you'll find those other uh, subscription boxes do not have the tools and the things that you'll use all the time like our box so um, yes it is the tool caddy from 651 so we're super excited to get that um, and it's so much fun red is gearing us up for Christmas amen I love it now let's talk about exclusive patterns because this is what gets me excited every single month um, is for these exclusive exclusive patterns so what we've got when it comes to our custom patterns is you get two sheets of custom 12 by 15 pattern heat transfer vinyl and Rachel I am drawing a blank I believe these are our heat transfers I think so I believe I think so and then these right here are our pattern uh, vinyl. Who knows? Maybe it'll be a surprise in your box. I need to clarify. But these right here, I'm pretty sure, are going to be your 12 by 15 inch patterned heat transfer vinyl. And they're so fun. Guys, these are going to be able to create some really flawless projects and it's going to be so much fun. So guys, if you would like this, um, you will be able to opt in to make your material. And so, Tanner, how many uh, different tiers are there if someone wants to know how much it costs? So there's four different tiers and a six year, or excuse me, a six month or a um, six year subscription. Uh, I keep saying one six year. year. A one, a year one year or six month subscription, you get a free one time special gift. So yes, there's four different tiers. Um, Judy says, I'm shocked. No red buffalo checker palad. Guys, we're, we've got the green because you guys know we're really embracing the green this year. Um, and we wanted to do something that is very non-traditional so it is going to be so much fun and it is really awesome so this right here is going to be, it really elevate everything and when you look at these patterns together I don't know about you Rachel but I'm terrible at trying to style colors I'm terrible at trying to make things look good together so I'm glad Courtney is able to work with our designers to give us some patterns that are exclusive and they're all ready to use. Yeah, I agree. And then we also give you guys project cards yes. and things just to give mm -hmm. you a little inspiration of what colors would look good with what and things like that. Right, right, right. So you've got, you know, this right here, which is adorable. I love the peppermint straps. These are huge. You can check at this at Hobby Lobby. People are doing this all over. It's crazy fun. This right here, Rachel, what would you even consider like this right here? It's a little mismatched of, you know, what it's you like can do Holly with it. 
Yeah. Is, or what is it? It's a mistletoe. Mistletoe yeah, and then the mistletoe holly. Pack. And you've got the really green cute. still, so it's still so much fun. Um, I really, really love this pattern, and it's just so adorable. Um, and again, this is our test, you know, printing, so it is um, a little bit different sizes. So just, again, just so you know exactly what you're getting for these three right here, the, you're getting it in 12 by 12, uh, 651 or a cal or a cal 651 sheets this right here is printed 12 by 15 patterned um heat transfer bottle that you'll want to use your special caesar transfer tape with so that's a lot of fun and then you know these are your patterns but the box does not in there at all you're getting some bases so you've got some felt you're going to get a mason jar lid you are going to get this adorable wood slice um, and then you get your little pendant. So these right here are gonna be able to help you create some really awesome projects like so. I love this little polar bear and the painting technique on this is so adorable. Um, and then we actually used heat transfer vinyl and it's just a lot of fun to be able to make this. So really adorable. And if you guys had August box, you'll see we even pulled the jute twine from the August box to you know finish this one off. Lots of fun. And then and, uh, Charlotte says, how do you get this box? Charlotte, I'm going to drop the link and you go and you click uh, whichever tier you want and you can get your box today. Yes, it is so good. This is the last um, day to sign up if you want these patterns, this box. It is a one shot and done. It is the last day to get signed up for it. So go, go, go. Um, this right here, guys, I've not seen people take full advantage of felt and being able to iron on these for some awesome ornaments. So this right here is an amazing way for us to give you a cut file that you're gonna be able to cut, be able to iron on and have a lot of fun. So adorable. And then you may be thinking, Tanner, what can I do with all of this? Well guys, we used this adorable pattern um, and then we were able to use the, some other felt or really paper, cardstock, whatever you wanna use um, and ribbon to create another adorable ornament. So this is just the beginning of the ornaments that you're able to make with this box. So we're super excited for you guys to get your box um, and it's so much fun. So in addition, we also curate, you know, aside from you get a 12 by 15 sheet of regular transfer tape and then a 12 by 15 sheet of this Caesar um, heat resistant transfer tape for your pattern heat transfer vinyl. Um, and then we curate your colors. I love it. Look these, at all that vinyl. I'm gonna take these out of the box and put it on the white background because it looked a little dark. Do, 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 do. And Anna, Anna, we do not ship to Canada, but there are some forwarding services like yes. our Miss Sasset uh, uses. Mm -hmm. And it was just 18 extra dollars USD to get it shipped right. uh, to her in Canada. So definitely uh, consider that. Yes. Okay. So for colors, guys, we have two, so traditionally we have two specialty patterns in addition to our palette. So these are our, this is kind of like the copper that I love so much. Um, this is a Let's see if I know the exact dimensions of this. I'm looking at my reference sheet. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. So one sheet of 12 by 12 StarCraft Magic Vinyl in color red. And then you get um, five sheets of just typical or a Cal 651. So these are your five colors. And guys, these are looking a little bit darker, but do not feel like worried about that because you're still gonna be able to have a bright and white Christmas. A lot of what we're gonna do with this and I don't even know if Rachel knows this, but we've put in a huge frame order with Joseph. Oh and, yeah, you told me. And I'm so he excited. sent me pictures. Let me tell you, he's made probably triple what I asked for. <laughs> you know, good. Um, good. So we're gonna have to make a lot of Christmas frames and a lot of things. So you guys are gonna also want to make some awesome frames for your home. So these colors and things are gonna be perfect to collaborate with a lot of our patterns. And we have a plaid um, pattern that was just added to the site, which is go. I'm um, Rachel. We're it's gonna like have to. It's like a cut file. It's so it's cool. A, it's a plaid cut file. Yeah. But I saw something on in store, and I believe it was at the name of the store. I cannot remember. What was it called? What was it called? Was it? What'd you say? Oh Kirkland's my gosh! I love something? Kirklands. Thank you. Oh, okay, the Kirklands. Yeah. I love Kirklands, but they're they're one of those places where it's normally typically priced. Um, but anyway, 
it was a project and I just had to have the cut fall. So we're gonna be able to use some of these colors to make some really awesome things for your home. And then after the five sheets of 12 by 12 or a Cal 651, you get two 12 by 15 inch sheets of your Caesar Easy Weed. And I just need to show off this green because this is our oh. favorite, favorite, favorite green. Sorry, Rachel. Oh no, you're fine. Um, this is our favorite green. I'm getting you the exact name of the color. This is Isn't our it cadet, cadet green. green. Yeah. This is our green of the year. And this green right here, you need it for fall and you need it for Christmas. So this right here is something you're not gonna wanna miss out on um, in your box. So guys, what I love about our box is it's probably one of our most underrated products. So it's the last day if you want this box to get in. So please, please, please head on over there, get in so that you get access to all of the things that we have been able to show you. I'm gonna build the box back real quick. Um, you got your transfer tape, your tools, your bases, and then you cannot forget about your custom patterns that we love. So that is so much fun and we're really, really excited to bring to you the second edition of Maker Materials. And guys, thank you so much for being patient with us. We are so new to being able to deliver you guys um, amazing products to your door. Um, and we're really excited to curate them and thank you for the patience. So yes, Rachel, are there any questions? There is a question. So okay. one of them was, what are the boxes? And I said, it is our awesome monthly craft supply box. And I've got the link there yes. for everybody. Uh, Milady says, what wonderful colors are in the Thank box. Thank you. And then Jack is having some trouble hey, applying Jack. HTV to a vest that is 80 poly and 20 hmm. rayon, I think. And I think you're having trouble, Jack, is because you need cotton to do that unless you're using, what's that stuff called? Sport um, Flex. Sport Flex. Yeah. Yes, thank you, Rachel. This is a, an amazing solution. So, Jack, um, with your traditional heat transfer vinyl, like Rachel was saying, that goes on for cottons. Um, when you go to stretch material, when you go to poly um, and things like that, that's just traditionally stretch, you know, mm -hmm. athletic clothes. Um, and you need what is called a sport flex if you're talking Cricut lingo. If you're talking um, 651vinyl.com, what do they oh, call? Oh, do they have one? They do have stretch oh, I have um, no idea what from it's Caesar. Um, I think it's like stretch Caesar. Um, someone in the comments will be able to fill in my blank. But yeah, that is probably why it is not sticking. Um, and that is probably what I am would probably justify yeah, as why. That's so, probably why. And I think that rayon, I think that's like camp tent material. Yeah, you know, that yeah material. It, regular heat transfer vinyl isn't meant to stick to things like that. So right. yes, thank you guys for the support of the boxes. If you need your box, go ahead and grab it so that we're able to send you guys out the box because today is the last day to get in on that box. So we do want to make sure you get in on that um, so that we're able to give you all of the goodness. So yes, I'm going to grab my um, Cricut design space right here and it's going to be so fun. So this is adorable. I'm going to zoom on in and before we jump into it, Rachel, do we have any exact questions? I don't think so. You've answered just about all of them. Perfect. Perfect. So today we are working with um, what I call the um, oh, it's a font project. So right here, you know, working with patterned um, vinyl is not hard at all. It's very simple and very similar to what you would do, you know, with other things. So anywho, 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 um, what we're going to do is we're going to be able to go over to makersgonnalearn.com and you can see here, do, 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 do. First of all, if you've not went and checked out the plan options and everything for the box, you can just click that link Rachel's given you and you can see that it's the curated box, exclusive products, the project guides, um, and then six to 12 month subscribers get a free gift um, and the four payment plans. And this is still launch pricing. They will be going up to these prices. I just need to go in and change those. So anywho, um, Complipit's perfect with makers gonna learn cut files and you're gonna be able to spend more time crafting and less time overwhelmed at that craft store, which you guys know I spend a lot of time there overwhelmed. So I do it so you guys don't have to. But anyway, we're gonna go to fonts and we're working with fonts today. So if you guys um, are brand new to um, makers gonna learn, you guys know our fonts are 
only for yearly members, which means you have to commit to a year to get access to this part of the site. Now, if you're a monthly member and you're like, I want to get in on the fonts because these are amazing fonts, I want that commercial license, I want the bonuses and things like that, this right here is an amazing um, place to go once you've upgraded and it's so easy to upgrade um, if you you know you can check your dashboard to see if you can upgrade um, so go ahead and do that and then um, you'll be able to you know upgrade or you can just click the link Rachel's given you um, click on yearly and you'll be able to have that prorated so um, Melanie says if you join monthly do you have to pay each month Yes, it is a automatic payment profile. So that is just automatically taken care of for you with either our membership or with the subscription box. So yes, so anyway, you can scroll down and you can download your favorite fonts. Uh, Rachel, this Fishy Wishy, I, I still- We've still been dying to do uh, something with Fishy Wishy. I think we should just do something and then just like do a weeding challenge because <laughs> that's probably my biggest fear with that cup all. Um, but anywho, anywho, anywho. As you can see, there's so many different categories, but you can always find uh, what I love about, you know, the basic fonts, which is kind of what we're using today um, under basic. And, you know, we love our font Blake and Passion and, you know, all of those things. We have over so 200 good. of them. There's so many fonts. Yeah. Today we're using Wesley. So um, it's a great one. And, you know, you can always go ahead and check out the fonts and things if you're not a member. It'll just let you all know that, you know, fonts available for your members join now. So you're going to be able to kind of click on that and it'll take you right here. And right out of the gate, guys, we let you all know what you get for being a year member. You save three months, you get 80 plus fonts, commercial license, and the th three training classes incredible value if you are brand new to our channel this is what we recommend to everyone because you see all the additional value you get is right here for a lower price you pay $15.99 a month versus $19.99 a month so it is so so good and you get more for the lower price too. right right um, and it's very very important so so awesome and a lot of fun so anyway let's go over here um, to Cricut Design Space. Just take one. Um, you can just top this out and we have already been able to build it. It looks like we've attached it and kind of played around with it. So if you guys have not played around with our fonts, let us know what you would like us to, you know, teach. I see lots of questions. Um, Lita, uh, uh, Lita's posting links to some 40 Listen, companies. Listen, I wish I could like highlight that. That's Aww. awesome. We She's need so to, sweet. Can, can, we, can we take a screenshot of that? Because I would love to have that in an email. Let me, um, let me copy yeah, let's, it. Let's copy and paste that. Lita, thank you so much. We are going to be able to now put that in there for all of our friends that email us um, and let them know. You are so, so sweet. Um, Elaine says, waiting to see what you make with the music font. Elaine, we do have a really fun project with the music font that we'll have to we'll have to make for you very, very soon. Um, oh, I've used it twice. Fishy Wishy with infusible ink. Oh, that's a good idea. Post that in the Facebook group. Idea. Let us know. Allison has a fantastic question. Do you pay for the full year first or do you pay the 16 first? So Allison, it is a one-time initial fee. So you will pay that all up front for the year and then you don't have to worry about it for another year. So a lot of our friends that want that yearly membership, it is something you may have to budget for or things like that. But honestly, in that year membership tier, there's $400, $500 worth of value right out of the gate. So that is you know, a great justification for you to be able to make that commitment yeah, and that's and why you do pay everything up front mm -hmm. that's why you do get all those perks right and then everyone gets the printable guide which is fantastic but if you want the bonuses that we have for you please take full advantage of that so it's a lot of fun and we cannot wait to get crafty even more so yay and Lita's gonna post it in the Facebook group <gasps> for you, us thank you Lita awesome. you are so sweet thank you thank you thank you but again guys we are going to talk about working with fonts today and how you can do this same exact project so let's just go ahead and click on text and what you'll want to do is notice when you top in you know West for Wesley um, after you've downloaded your font you see that you're on the Cricut category so obviously not go find the Wesley font but then you just need to click on system and that's how easy it is to find Wesley so I like to break my projects down into 
um, each word is its own layer. So I'm going to type out please and just start lining this up. And then we're going to type out, you know, text and system in Wesley. Please just text. And Denise wants to know if we will have any writing fonts in the future. And I'm letting you know we will definitely have some writing fonts in the future. I know that a lot of people are asking for those that are formatted so it, you know, it's a single line instead of the double line that you see. So we're definitely working on that. So actually, one of the terrible things we've been researching as we find this out, um, Cricut, to our understanding, and if you guys have any, um, if you all know of any um, artists or independent companies that have access to writing fonts that are not licensed by Cricut, um, to my understanding and the communication I've had with a lot, a lot of um, artists is that it's we're not able to do that. We're not able to have um, writing fonts like we were Cricut. For some. We, we have can't been. Have we have fonts? been. It's been. It's been a long time trying to figure out what we need to do to tell the machine not to outline it and things like that. Um, and unfortunately, Cricut owns that like intellectual property to make it um, just a. Oh. Just a one-line font to our knowledge, but like I said, if there's ever a time you find another um, SVG company or font designer out there that is making single-lined um, fonts that are not um, in the Cricut, like under the Cricut category of fonts, let us know. Um, we'll keep our eye on it and our pulse on it. But yeah, I met someone at the Silhouette Summit who works with um, a lot of companies, and she has designed thousands of fonts, truly thousands, um, and it is so good. So um, she was going through the same struggle as we were, and I was like, oh my gosh, I can't do this. And she's like, neither can I. <laughs> um, so yeah, that's uh, you know a little fun. Uh, Melanie says, what if you are just monthly? Well, Melanie, that's a great question. If you're in our membership and you're just monthly, you get access to our Facebook group, our printable guide, and our cut file library. So it is $19.99 a month, which is an amazing deal to get access to all of that, considering the fact that you get access to over 14, 1300 cut files, um, and you get access to that project category plus the Facebook group, and you still get our printable guide. So either way you decide to choose membership, um, you know, you can choose what is best for your budget now and upgrade later or anything like that. So it's a lot of fun. Um, oh my gosh, Francie, we are barely gotten started. We have been talking about um, a lot of fun, like a lot of the box stuff. So we're just getting started with the project. I've just been formatting my project. So no big deal. No fresh. No you haven't rush. missed anything. You're not missing a thing. So anyway, Rach, uh, let's dive back in. We, you know, just to recap, let's go over to layers. Let me sh showcase what I've got. So these right here represent in the layers panel, each word is its own layer. So right here, you know, we've got our, you know, our phrases and things, and I'm just lining these up just for how I would like it. And once, you know, you're happy with that, you're going to be able to, you know, hold that down and you're going to have to do a few things. You can attach it, um, you can weld it, or you can group it. Grouping it is only a visual tool that you are going to use in design space. Group does not connect to the mat whatsoever. It has nothing to do with the mat. For example, let's group that. So now when I think I want to move just, it's going to move it all. So that's what group does, but watch when we click make it, what happens? Um, it's going to reformat literally everything. So group has no hold or no connection to the mat in your cutting. Attach is where you'll want to be for this project because um, it's not a permanent thing. And you're going to see um, it sets up each of these you know, perfectly for us. So just like so, you have that there and it's awesome. So we're gonna be able to just delete that out. And now we have this right here and it's already attached for us and it's so, so good. And sometimes you have to really zoom in to see these these lines. But oh, that's a pin pin tool oh, project yes. if I've ever seen one. Oh yes, we are gonna have a lot of fun to talk about our pin pin tool. Um, and in layers, you can see this right here. It is all, you know, attached together. So if you, you know, wanted to, you could detach that and edit 
anything here. If we were to weld this, let's go ahead and weld it. Um, if we welded that, this is now a permanent solution. We cannot go back and change anything in our project. We would have to start completely fresh. Um, and it's really, you know, something that why when we're working with a one layer like we are today, we recommend you guys to just have it um, attached. So if you want to save this project and go back to it later, you will be able to with for very less work. So um, it is a lot, a lot of fun. A lot of people are asking and talking about the brand new Silhouette Cameo 4 um, launch. Yeah, do we know anything about that Silhouette? So here's, here's the deal. I was at the launch event in Hawaii and I did get to see a little bit of the demonstration on the Silhouette Cameo 4. Um, it was a prototype machine, first of all. Um, second of all, I do not have the machine. I've not got to do a head-to-head -head comparison cutting a piece of felt cutting this, you know, doing this and that. Um, it seems to be a machine that is going to be worth the um, comparable um, to the Cricut Maker. Uh, a few things is it is made out of, I believe, like more plastic material. That's how they're able to get it cheaper. Um, it still weighs, I think, like 24 pounds, so it's pretty heavy. Um, but I don't know exactly how it's gonna line up. I'm really, really excited to put it to the comparison. Um, so I will be ordering mine and getting mine, you know, figured out if, um, you know, anything like that, but we're really excited. And congratulations to Dazzling D. If I leave suddenly, it's because my second granddaughter is about to be born by C-section. Congratulations. Well, congratulations, we love that. Um, but yes, Alicia says, thank you. I don't use group, but now I know exactly what it does. Exactly, exactly. And in cases where we have an upcoming project that we talk about print and cut and you know where we can cut out all these layers and we can build it where we can do print and cut. Um, those projects that are coming up when we are cutting out all these different layers and they're in different colors, but on design space, we need it to be together. That is where group comes in, my friend. And that's where we will want to use it to keep our sanity in Cricut. So I'll talk more about that in that video. So stay tuned and, and it's so fun. Tanner, when are we launching our awesome silhouette stuff? <sighs> okay. So sister friend 143, Thank you for asking. What we decided to do was for our time, it was not beneficial to have a whole course on the Silhouette Cameo 3 when the Silhouette 4 came out today. So we decided to push back our content on the Silhouette Cameo 3 and 4 um, for the 4 so we can do the education with both machines so that we didn't have to update a bunch of content, you know, what? two months later. Um, so that is why now that the machine is out, we'll be getting ours and we will be deep diving into that comparison. And in this whole time, guys, we have been putting together a ton of education for um, simple things in the software and all that fun stuff. So yes, that is a great thing. But with that being said, our deadline and our estimated time of arrival, our ETA, if you will, will be the end of October. So that we'll have, you know, the majority of, you know, the rest of September. And again, it may push into November. We are still waiting for clarification, but it'll be a lot of fun and it's going to be so great. And we have, we had a ton of questions pop up. Oh, great. <laughs> um, CJ said, if I wanted to delete a design in Cricut Design Space that I saved, can that be done? Yes, you are more than welcome to delete a design in Cricut Design Space. You just have to go to your, like, my projects. My projects. Right? And the, there's so. like a three dot thing and it'll just say delete or share. And um, we'll skip to Melanie's first. Melanie hey, said, Melanie. I'm asking about the box. Yes. I joined monthly membership. <gasps> Congratulations. Will I have to buy the box myself or is it taken automatically? That is a great question. Well, Melody, what we love about Makers Gonna Learn is it is definitely a pick your own adventure type company. Um, you can be a member and not take advantage of Maker Material. You can take advantage of the Maker Material and your membership and a summit or a course, whatever you want. Um, but yes, you will have to sign up for that separately because they are two totally separate um, payment automations. So, yeah. And uh, I love this question. Um, you were talking about how group, you know, you don't yes. really use group enough. Then if we're talking about weld, why would we use weld? So that's a fantastic question um, for B2989B, love the name. Mm -hmm. um, 
But that's a great question. So when you have two images that you are truly wanting to weld into one, welding is a permanent solution. If you take a look at what we're cutting today, these are just letters. There's nothing overlapping. Um, if there was anything overlapping and we attached it, that would still give us the cut line where they overlap. Just like um, a cursive font is just the like, best example. Yes, just like with your cursive fonts, you have to weld those together after kerning or you would actually, a paper clip is temporary. So with the temporary paper clip, you would be able to still peel off those letters individually um, and be able to put them wherever you want. When you weld something together, it's going to take away the cut line where those two connect and turn into one perfect cut line. So yeah, that's a great question. And um, I think we're all caught up now. Yeah, you see, Sue says, I just joined monthly in PayPal Auto, my next payment end of August. I, Sue, August is long gone, so I believe you mean September, <laughs> um, depending on what service you you picked. Um, no, you picked monthly, so you'll get your next payment would be at the end of October. So yes, lots and lots of fun. Um, but yay, congratulations, guys. And if there's any more listening or watching and you're like, oh my gosh, everyone's joining and you know, I would love to join too. Let us know if you have any questions or comments regarding membership, a box, anything like that. We would love to help you guys stay creative as September is probably the best time to join so that you're with us October, November, and December to get crafty for the holidays. It's truly the best time of year to have a community of crafters behind you. And our year membership is our flagship product. It's our number one recommended product. So we're super excited to have that for you. So yay, I love it. Um, it's a lot of fun. But anyway, let's hop back over here. And as you guys can see, we are attached. So we're gonna go over here to make it and we're gonna go to replace. And we're cutting vinyl. So when you cut vinyl, um, you don't need to mirror it. And we are gonna be able to press continue. Do, 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 do. Look at our pattern we're using today. It is so awesome. Tanner likes to say that those are gourds. <laughs> are they not though? Well, there's probably gourds in there. Gourds, pumpkins. Like gourd squash. Squash, whatever. Pumpkins. I don't know. I don't know, Rach. Who knows? Um, we're going to set this to vinyl with more pressure just because uh, we, we love more pressure here. It's force of habit. I don't know about you guys. A lot of you love to chime in and today is a easily a fast mode project. So um, we'll now be able to press that flashing cricket button and let it go. Charlotte, no, there is no need to get, let me just show you real quick. So on the box, you may be confused for what you've got going on right here. Oh, thanks. So sorry, Rachel. No, I was just, fine. I was acting like they could see it. Um, you do not have to put a coupon code in to get these rates right here. These are standard and there's no code needed. So that's a great, great question. Um, and yes, your membership does work with the Silhouette machine and there's going to be lots of education coming for the Silhouette as well as Brother Scan and Cut. So if you want to opt in now to start crafting with the art and get in the membership and things like that, it is so, so good um, but yes so I'm trying to wait to do yearly until you have the silhouette info because when I use my silhouette things are not working the auto blade cuts too deep very new with all of this well sister friend 143 that is a great you know thing that will have education for you um, to help hopefully take care of some of those issues but in the meantime if you you know need to join the community there's a lot of amazing people that are truly awesome in the group that could probably help you with a lot of those issues um, and it's a lot of fun so if you want to join now so that you're gonna be like one of the first to get it feel free or just you can wait for that silhouette education to be um, released so it's gonna be a lot of fun all in the gourd family thank you Judith <laughs> yeah it's all they're all gourd oh my gosh I love it I love it mm -mm -mm. so yay Christy says, is that the original grandfathered pricing? Uh, yes, Christy, we still have not updated that pricing for the maker material, um, if that's what you're asking. We need to do that and we're gonna do that ASAP, um, but yes. Aw, oh, Jenny says, I adore the pattern. I used it this weekend um, and gave it to my friends today. She flips, she loves the colors. I love the colors. Um, it is so much fun and they're very fall-like. So you've got the, the 
pops of colors that you would never think would be very fall um, like and it's so so good so yay we love it we love 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 it um and guys let us know if you have any questions people are sending me some of their information on their um summit class and their, their classes are shaping up to be so nice so we're so excited so be sure to um you know jump in if you have not already and so, Vanessa yeah. says is the payment for the three month supply of the maker material box an automatic payment every three months yes as long as you cancel before that um, payment goes through um, if you ever need to cancel but yes it is an automatic payment profile that PayPal sets up for us so we don't have to worry about managing it or going in or not getting a box or things like that so okay guys we are gonna be able to go in now and cut it out um, so right here we're gonna go about at the seven inch mark and then we're gonna go down to the four inch mark and we're just cutting out that excess so that we can save it for another project because you you know you got to be careful with your special patterns that are exclusive so now we peel off the excess vinyl from the back and now we are go burnish just to and make Tanner, sure the bottle's down. Shannon's Creations has a really good question. Hey, she Shannon. said, what is the purpose for cutting in fast mode? I've never used it before. Oh my gosh. Well, if you are a, you know, a crafter that wants to get done faster, then you will love fast mode. I absolutely adore it. Rachel isn't a fan. I would, is, would, would, you, would we call you a closeted fast mode user when do you find yourself using fast mode Rachel I would use the fast mode on you know large projects things like that but anything smaller like the inside of these letters made me nervous that you use <laughs> fast mode and things like that I, f I feel like if you you took the e with oh me. oh we'll, we'll save it we'll oh look it's right there it's right here I feel I like if the cricket <laughs> was gonna go that fast it would all the time but I, I get it for certain projects, you know, if you get a little bit um, impatient and things like that. Clearly, I, I get impatient it. very often. Which is fine. Which is fine. Um, I love fast mode for almost every project just because it is really um, an amazing, you know, it speeds up the process. And there's not too many times that, you know, it's hurt me, quote unquote. Um, as in from a project standpoint of making projects like fast mode is just go get your project done faster um, and it does make a little bit more noise so Cricut you know a lot of docketing machine companies have to be very weary of the noise it makes because that's a big customer complaint so t potentially I have no idea what Cricut would say on this topic but um, you know they would potentially make it a little bit quieter um, and slower to make it quieter so I've just saved my E. This is a lot of fun. I promise you guys, I, there's been a lot of these issues lately and I'm not meaning to make these issues. I think it's just that I'm getting a little too confident in my cricketing and I need to step back. So anyway. And uh, there are things Shannon said that she'll try. There are a couple things like light card stock, vellum, and things like that that you don't want to use. Right, on. yeah, we it don't really use it for everything. Stuff. But vinyl, heat transfer vinyl is pretty safe. Um, heat transfer vinyl is pretty, pretty safe. We love it. Um, so yay. I'm just weeding now, and I'm going to grab the pin pin tool um, because I love it, but we need to just reposition this end down and if you got our august um, shipment you would have got a pin pin tool so we love 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 the pin pin tool and john paul i think paul just joined in he seems like a first timer he Hello. says can you use this cutter for stencil decals and to cut thin plastic yeah, um thin plastic i would have to you know th that's a very broad term true but um yes you are able to make all your stencil decals and we love the cricket maker so um you will really enjoy using that it's a really awesome machine um and it's probably one of the best on the market um, their software right now is predominantly on the desktop, um, and what I mean by that is on it's an online platform. They do currently have a beta um, for their offline version, so if you're interested in that, oops, 
if you're interested in that, um, you can check it out, um, especially for our friends that need help with, um, you know, Wi-Fi connectivity and things like that. This is very helpful. I wonder how that works. Design space yeah. offline. We, I downloaded it and played around with it really quickly. Um, so I haven't got to, you know, make any videos on it. But yeah, guys, if you are excited about offline capability with Cricut, let us know in a comment. Someone said they'd already tried some of our files with it. Yay! Woohoo! And this vinyl is just so nice to weed, guys. Like, I just love it. I'm still working on my end right here, though. Aside from, you know, this little mistake of trying to weed too fast, which nothing new here. Um... But yeah, look at this. Uh, Judith said, love the design space offline. It works great. Yay. It's about time. You know, you, a lot of people, that was a huge complaint for people that, um, you know, just don't have the connectivity to internet, like consistent. A lot of people... Um, have to use their hotspots on their phone, and those are not always, um, you know, 100%. I mean, I think we've all at some point have had internet outages and things where we've had to use our hotspots. Um, and they have came a long way since the first hotspot on a phone that I had, um, like in 2012 and whatnot. But, you know, there's definitely more room for improvement, and that's why in other news, I'm really excited for the new iPhone to launch. And Oma B said, do you need a new blade for your Cricut? It's just this font, guys. Uh, it's because the font is a little bit more detailed. Oh, it's so detailed. Yeah, but our font, the our blade is great. Their blade's good. Yeah, we cut it at about six inch width. Um, so it does take you a little minute to get in on, on the little pieces. But yeah, we did cut it in fast mode too. So if that's what you're talking about, we just love fast mode. Or excuse me, um, more pressure. More pressure is just going to help you in general. Look and um, there we have a newbie that says, silly question, what is the blue under the letters? Oh, that's a great question. So this is um, Oracle 651 vinyl we printed our patterns on. Um, so what that means is that, you know, you get a sheet. You know, there's a sticker underneath this. So this is just that, you know, backer piece. And we're going to use vinyl. So um, with transfer tape. So stick with us and you'll see it all come together. But essentially this backing blue piece is going to keep us from, you know, not ruining the stickiness of our vinyl. It's probably one of the better ways to describe it. And CJ says, I use Android devices. Do you have to use an iPad to do everything? Oh my gosh, no. We, we are an Apple company here, but you're more than welcome to use Android or Apple or Windows or whatever you got, you know, they have an app for it. I do have to say the iPhone app um, is a little bit more, you know, detailed and has User a little bit more. User maybe. Um, yeah, there's just more opportunity on the, in the iPhone app. So, yeah, so good. But, yes. So here we go. I've been able to weed it out. Now we're going to use some transfer tape. So we're going to cut down our transfer tape. And this is how I always do it. I put it over here and just size it down. Just like so. People say they're loving the, the design space offline because a lot of people have limited data right, and this without right. limited Wi-Fi. Totally understand. Totally, totally understand. So, okay. So now we're going to use this transfer tape. So if you are brand new, definitely stick with us because we're going to blow you away to keep this all organized. So we do the taco method, which means, you know, you position it like this and then you, you kind of just lay it down. And then you're going to want to use some type of scraper tool. I'm going to open up our maker material box and grab our squeegee. squeegee. Love the squeegee. Um, and we're just going to be able to squeegee this out. And just like so, this is quite larger than other ones and things like that. So it's so, so good. 
And again, guys, if you need this box, be sure to check it out at the um, Maker Material link Rachel has dropped for us. So you can subscribe. Today is the last day to subscribe to get in on our ornament specific box. So lots and lots of fun. So there we go. And now we're gonna be able to burnish again. And before we pull this off, this is something very important we're gonna talk about, um, is our surface we're putting it on. So whatever surface you want to use, um, we are going to be able to, um, you know, put it down. But to do it, you need to clean the surface. So we have two surfaces to choose from today. We have the back of this one, of the one we already made, or we have the frame. Both of these are Chocotour surfaces. We love the surfaces from Chocotour. They just get us as crafters. Um, but when you have these, you wanna clean the surface. So we use rubbing alcohol and a Dollar Tree pump and a piece of paper towel to make that happen. So you take it and pump it like twice so you can see the alcohol. Then you would just take it and clean this off. This is going to remove any hand residue. This is going to remove any, you know, things on your, your piece. But, you know, this is wood right here. And I'm actually, you know, would also do it, do it on here just to help clean the surface because this particular surface is not technically, um, I just don't feel like it's all the way wood. It is a very nice, um, surface. So anyway, let's just go ahead and put it on the back of this one so that we give you all the tips, but you could easily put it on a frame. And you know, we've already burnished. So now what we're going to do is peel back and just look at how the vinyl is staying right where we need it. Oh, the middle of that A I see. And this is a great time to talk about this. Yeah. This is also a awesome time to talk about reverse weeding. This is technically reverse weeding here. Um, weeding after you've, you know, put it on your mat, on your transfer tape. So that was that easy to weed it up. Again, guys, you've watched me. This E was lost in my, um, uh, you know, piece of vinyl. So it got lost and, you know, it was, it was literally stuck in this piece of vinyl um, before it looked this bad. And I was able to pull it out and put it back. So vinyl is very forgiving and, you know, we're able to weed it out and I fixed the, the end right there and everything. So it is so, so fun. But yeah, we are now gonna be able to take this and position it down. We're gonna move it up more towards the top and then you're gonna be able to, you know, let that lay flat and then you kind of burnish it out. So yay. Go ahead and center it up if you don't care. Oh, thanks Rachel. So yeah, we're gonna be able to zoom out just a hair and then, you know, finish burnishing. Elizabeth said, I always like using that font. It has a little something extra. It does. It really, really does. I love it. And sometimes if your vinyl's not wanting to stay, I like to go in at a different angle. And then I like to burnish just a little bit more. Just like so. Position it down. And ta-da! It is now, there. if only the trick-or-treaters would listen to the sign. I know. This is an adorable sign to have when you are going to, you know, have something um, and you're not going to be at your home. And I don't know about you guys. I was talking to my neighbor, and apparently we get crazy on 4th of July. I said 4th of July. Um, I was thinking crazy. about that, too, Tanner. How crazy <laughs> it's going to be. Yeah, it's going to be crazy. There's here. no parking, apparently, on the street um, and things like that. But, guys, one last thing. We barely use this transfer tape and transfer tape does not grow on trees so please take it and put it back on the backing sheet and save it for another project just just do your bank account a favor you know what i'm saying you'll be able to reuse this two three more times um and it's a lot a lot of fun so it is so good and it is a lot a lot of fun so a lot of people anyway. are saying that these are great for uh People who leave for trunk or treats and yeah, things like exactly, that, that they do other exactly. things. Exactly. So we love it and you get some really fun fall patterns. So it is a lot of fun. But yes, what questions do we have? Uh, let's see. 
How, um, I love this. <laughs> how much do you decorate on the holidays? Well, I mean, guys, we have new videos and new projects coming to you almost every single day. So therefore, we, we, we craft a lot. We're doing a lot. We do it a lot, a lot, a lot. And it's so, so good. So yeah, we love it. It's one of our favorite hobbies. Um, and our homes are very much decorated. So um, it is so good. Um, but yes, we have Deborah um, giving. So Deborah, what do we do with all the projects you make on YouTube? So we have them all organized in our storage unit um, because we have to reference them. So when we're making like other holidays, we have to have them stockpiled so that we're able to reference like last year's holiday projects and we're able to reference like last year's Easter projects and compare them to maybe what we're doing now with the cut file um, and things like that. So there are a lot of projects here that we keep on hand but it is because we're like we're investing the time to make the project and it would take so much time to remake a project instead of just keep it um so that we're able to show you guys some really fun projects um, for years holidays. Come, we yeah. have just about all the projects it's an amazing made, stock awesome. yeah. and it is so so good but again rachel uses a lot of the projects i use a ton of the projects in my home as well um so it's just like keeping those so it's a lot a lot of fun um so Melanie says, I'm a monthly member. I want to know how you are charging. Do I have to have to use the link to pay for the September box? Um, will it be taken out of my PayPal account? So Melanie, um, if you are looking, talking about Maker Material, you'll click the link for Maker Material. You'll choose your subscription. Um, you know, there's four tiers. And then you will be able to choose um, how you're paid. Um, it will be linked to a um, PayPal account. And then um, you can choose, like, do I want to pay with this bank account, this debit card, this credit card, after you commit and you know do that. So it's really fun. And if you guys need some more details on registering and things like that, let us know because we're filming some really new training tutorials, um, screen shares and things. So yes, oh, we have someone saying, does your house not get cluttered? Um, so it is so good. Um, our organization, Rachel's Top Notch, Somebody, if you could try to organize better than Rachel, I would put money on Rachel. Oh, would uh, you? <laughs> yes. Uh, so Rachel organized this then by category. So we have fall projects, holiday projects, Easter projects, apparel, all of these organized. Um, but when you're, if you're talking about just home decorating, I think the way when you're decorating for the holidays is to kind of go with a few big elements and then accent pieces. So you don't have to, you know, DIY everything. Um, and it also, you know, making sure you're styling your projects best and things like that. So Courtney's in charge of all of that. Um, and we just get to make some really fun projects. So yeah. And Alicia says, I've seen some posts in the Facebook uh, comments that those of us that order the six month or the year box membership we're gonna get a prize. I yes. thought the prize was the pin pin tool. Well, Alicia, the prize is not the pin pin tool. Oh. That is actually part of your August yeah. shipment. Everybody got a pin Everyone pin, everybody got a pin, got pin, the pin prize. tool. So you're actually getting another surprise. <laughs> we love it. Um, so yeah, you answered you know, a, little, a little question for us. In addition, you probably were wondering why you had to answer that question. Um, so we'll be putting that together in the next few months, or excuse me, the few weeks to ship out to you guys. But there will be a cutoff for that coming. So it's a lot of fun. Um, do you not run out of ideas? Rachel, I do have to say, there are times that we can run out of ideas. There's, we've um, hit slumps before yeah, for yeah. sure. Yeah, I think it's more of a slump. I think it's like that up and down where you're like, okay, here's a lot of ideas and like, you know, he, you know, there's times where you're like, okay, I cannot, you know, do this anymore. But honestly, for me, it's um, kind of going out and seeing what people are doing in just home decor in general. Um, just seeing where they, um, you know, are doing really awesome things. And then being like, okay, what can my die cutting machine do to make this better or make this cheaper? So then you're able to come up with some really awesome ideas. Um, and that also inspires a lot of new cut files. Like I was telling at the beginning of the show, our awesome plaid pattern cut file, um, that one, you can see was inspired by you know a piece of wall art at Kirkland's, and then we also got inspired to make a really awesome um, fall sign with fabric on the back instead of just wood because we saw that in so many different places. So yeah, again, but those things are also like forty and fifty bucks, right. and we're like we no we, we can't afford it, yeah. so we, we wouldn't want to do that. So yeah, it's a lot of fun. Oh my gosh, Elizabeth says surprise my mommy with an edible arrangement for her birthday. Off topic, but excited. Well, Elizabeth, that is so sweet. I used to love those 
those commercials. I'm like, <laughs> look at that. They made a flower. Oh out my of gosh. Pineapple. I was about to say, Rachel, have you ever done an edible arrangement? I've never seen one in person. No, um, I would but love, I bet I she adored it. That would be awesome. I bet she adored it. So, yes. How does your how do your white stuff not get dirty? Oh, this is a great question as well. If you've seen my house tour, which we have not posted my official house tour, but or if you can't tell from the, the background, studio, yeah. um, I have to say my house is getting scuffed a little bit more than I would like because um, it's white walls and white this and white countertops or white cabinets. Um, so a magic eraser has been my friend recently. A Maybe good some touch up paint a couple times a year. A Maybe, bit of patch job. but yeah. So for projects, I mean, you know. We just try to take good care of it. If there's a stain on it, you know, get it out with some, um, you know, different cleaning stuff. But yeah, we do we do the what we can. So yeah. So, oh my gosh, John says bought the Cricut cutter two days ago for Michaels for me and my son. Well, John, you're going to love it. Your son's gonna love it. You're gonna be able to make so many awesome decals, awesome projects, do some car stuff. Um, if you need anything, be sure to reach out. Watch some of our videos. We have so many videos. It's hard for you guys to get the video you need. But um, a tip: if you like our teaching style and things like that, um, search what you're looking for in YouTube search and then add my name, Tanner Bell, um, and then that way the channel will pop up potentially first or in the first few um, to help you guys see, you know, if what we've done on the topic, um, type in the material, type in the t like technique you need to know. Um, you know, we have things on reverse weeding, we have things on tips for mastering vinyl, I mean, everything. Um, but it, again, guys, if you love what you, you, we do here and you're brand new to Cricut, I highly recommend checking out our membership because it's the one place that you're gonna be able to get education, inspiration, and motivation to use your machine. So like if you just got the machine, you could watch our training videos on setting it up and enjoying, and then um, you can check out our artwork, and then you know you can watch our continual videos to get that you know help that you need and to get excited to make new projects. So it's awesome. When will the September box be mailed out. I hope my issues will be solved by then. I have not received the August box, but watching the videos, so I'll be ready when it gets here. Jackie, if you are one of the, we have two people um, that says their box is delivered, um, and it's actually, you know, our customers are saying it's not. So we're tracking down those boxes right now, and, and it's going to be a lot of fun. And I don't mean to like question them, but I Ask got it. a package too, and I thought it was not delivered, and I'm sure you guys have checked. I'm just saying, it actually fit in my mailbox. And I was like, this package fit in my mailbox. So check Crazy. your mailbox. Check everywhere. Case. You never know. It did ship USPS. So if you do have a large mailbox, um, potentially the box did fit in there. And that's a great thing. So check around. To let you all know, again, it is not in the box that we've talked about. It is in a brown 651 vinyl 14 by 4 by 4 box. So it may be something that you're, um, you know, different and it's going to be a lot of fun. So we will be shipping the September box. Um, it is currently da, 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 September 10th and we will be shipping the box hopefully by around the 20th. You know, our estimated ideal date for the boxes is the 15th. So ending, you know, sh like orders on the 10th, shipment by the 15th for this month's box since we shipped the first one way too late we're moving it up about like eight seven to eight days and then once you know by october's box there's no reason why we shouldn't have it out by the 15th so check it out for the 20th and we'll again alert you guys when those have shipped and those notifications and things like that and jessica said she just ordered her mini easy press <gasps> yay i ordered mine yesterday too jessica and guys we love it if you all love um shopping at cricut be sure to use our shop cricut link down below um, that supports the channel and you guys have been using it quite a bit so we really appreciate that that helps us afford to buy amazing supplies and things like that so it's so nice um and it costs nothing to you guys Jenny says the membership is so worth it. I'm a hobby crafter and do not sell and still pay for the membership. It's so fun. Uh, creativity, projects, support, inspiration, and fun. And Jenny's probably one of my faves. She's so sweet. <laughs> Thanks for those kind words. So um, it's a lot of fun. Julie does mention that we did have a terrible um, issue. And I'm everyone just, was affected. <laughs> everyone was affected. Um, you got a new craft given name. Enjoy. So, so your package did come to your homes uh, for the August shipment, but you had a new name. Um, and we were so sorry about that. We located um, you know, the problem and it, it will not happen again. So yeah, it's great. 
But yes, so, so much fun, and I hope you guys have a fantastic uh, Tuesday. We'll see you back here tomorrow for another awesome project, and I cannot wait to see you guys get your September boxes and enjoy that August box. So see you guys later. Bye!